Welcome back to At Your Leisure. I'm Reagan Ledbetter. The air is a little bit cooler. The leaves are turning. Soon, it's going to be winter. We're at Hillside Tire and Service. I'm standing next to Tom, and we are needing to maybe winterize our cars, I'm thinking. Start thinking about it for sure. Yeah. Um, fall time, you just start thinking about winter coming up and getting your car prepared so you don't get stuck somewhere where you don't want to be when it's very, very cold, no, whether I... it's uh, jump starting or just issues with the vehicle on the road somewhere, so. What's the first thing I need to think about? Um, I would worry, I would get your coolant checked. It gets really cold, so I would make sure your coolant level protection is gonna be cold enough to handle the temperature so that nothing doesn't hurt your engine, per se. Um, then I would probably go to your tires. Obviously, the air pressure is going to drop in your tires. You want to make sure you have adequate air pressure so you don't cause an issue with your tires. Do I need to be changing my tires to any kind of winter tire, or is my average tire going to make it through the winter? Um, that would be the third thing, would be checking tread depth or checking checking your tire wear. Um, so some tires are actually mountain flake rated in all season, which means they're going to be adequate for the winter time. If you're driving most of the time in the valley, a good all season tire should be adequate for you. If you're going to be going up to the canyons or whatever, you might want to get something a little bit more aggressive or, or, or a winter tire. Uh, most of it's just your traction. Um, just having a good tire. Obviously, if you're off-roading stuff, it's probably going to be deeper snow or wherever you're going. Um, more kind of uh, almost like putty, so it's going to stick together. So you want something that's going to clean the tread base out easier so you get better traction and don't get stuck. All right, and tire pressure, it's like the located on my tire. It'll tell me plaque. what I need. On your uh -huh. tire or to make it easier on your door plaque or in most vehicles on the driver's side, if you open that, it'll tell you what the factory recommends. Part of uh, doing a winter check on your vehicle would be checking your wiper blades as well. Obviously, if it's a nice rainstorm or a snow, you want to be able to clean your windshield off so you can continue to see where you're driving. Um, part of it is as well as the washer fluid. Um, there's different types of washer fluid. We generally use the winter washer fluid so it doesn't freeze. Are cars usually in good shape when they come in here, or are you thinking, oh gosh, people need to really pay attention to their vehicles better? You'd be surprised in the middle of winter when it's snowing that people come in with ball tires and stuff and they leave with ball tires. It's just something they don't want to spend money on. So it's it's amazing every year that people still get around, so. Well, Hillside Tire is going to take care of you and make sure Absolutely. that you and your family are going to be safe driving in your vehicle, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. All right, come see Tom. More at your leisure head. Hey guys, if you like that video, you're going to want to watch all of our other AYL videos. You're going to want to like it, you're going to want to share it, and you're going to want to subscribe, right? See all the buttons right here? <laughs> this is what you're going to want to do, click, right? Click, click, click. on them, because we have some really cool videos, all kinds of behind the scenes stuff, bloopers of Alicia crashing and stuff. Why are you going to sell me out like that, Steven? <laughs> so you want to click all of these things and subscribe to our channel, because At Your Leisure is awesome, and uh, we'll see you here for more videos.